So at this time, I want to guys to welcome our special guest commentator and the man who will be presenting the Tri-State Tournament Championship to the winner of this finals match, Rendell General Manager, Carmen Michael! Carmen Michael hits the curtain with that Tri-State Championship in hand. He will be joining me at the booth for this main event as we crown a new champion. Are you going to be okay? Are you used to work with him? Uh, we'll be all right. I think we'll figure it out. That is our main event of the evening, and it is for the Tri-State Championship. Hello, GM Carmen. How you doing, buddy? Good to see you. It's a pleasure to see you, Rob, for a historic night here at Retinal Wrestling. Blatant debauchery as we patiently await both competitors here challenging for that Tri-State Championship. Well, Hunter Drake certainly Making the crowd wait here, Birmingham, Alabama, in our debut at Work Play Theater. And uh, Rob, not coming alone. No, and this has been the case all night. This has been very much Carney's night here at Work Play, with the exception of Nick Iggy in his match against Kenzie Page, Hunter Drake, and Kerry Awful. At least in the record books have been successful here tonight. I'm sure Kerry Awful's face is telling him a different story. Yeah, trust me when I say no one is as frustrated as I am. I mean, from the get-go, the Carnies have been sticking their nose into this tournament. I mean, we all saw what happened with the drawing for the names who would be in this tournament here tonight. And, I mean, frankly, we'll address that at another time. It is what it is. Unfortunately, I was gone trying to make some more signings, but... Here we are, our main event, Hunter Drake and Finesse facing off for that Tri-State Championship. Certainly has been an interesting tournament thus far here tonight. comes the other half of this finals match. Totally plastic, Vanessa, a hell of a match earlier this evening against Brandon Williams, absolutely earning his spot here in the finals as to where it feels like Hunter Drake was destined to be here since the beginning. Well, it certainly seems like whether it be fate or whether it be the Carnies, Hunter Drake as you mentioned, destined to be here. Uh, fate may have been swayed a little bit in that one. <laughs> but nonetheless, I wanted to get up close and personal here. I wanted to be here personally to see this matchup. Keep an eye on things here on the outside. I'm hoping we have a nice, clean fight, Rob. Well, let's keep it that way. What's the point?
see that championship in the hands of Ref Kev. The Tri-State Championship joining all the gold here in Retinal along with the heavyweight championship held by Derek Neal and the tag team championship held by the hard targets. Match officially underway. Of course, the Tri-State Championship, a championship belt carried over from Crux Wrestling will continue that lineage. However, here at Retinal Pro Wrestling, a brand new addition. And one of these two men you see right here will be your first, first ever Retinal Pro Wrestling Tri-State Champion. And an interesting note with that Crux branding finesse. Originally a product of the Crux Wrestling School as he takes a double leg takedown immediately on Hunter Drake and starts throwing bombs. Wasting no time and how good must that feel if you're finesse? Finesse originally trained by that man on the outside of the ring, Kerry Awful, and now taking on Kerry Awful's newest protege and Hunter Drake in the finals of this tournament. Wants the head scissors, but gets reversed by Drake. Hunter, oh, look, look at the core strength there from Finesse. He manages to pull himself up, and now exchanging blows. Finesse Ooh. just dropping Hunter Drake all the way to the outside. That was a far way down. A nasty spill for the heartbreak Carney, and Finesse now giving chase, making their way into the crowd here at work play. And Finesse has put up with enough tonight, especially after seeing what happened whenever Hunter Drake took on his tag team partner, Jameson Shook, earlier in round one. No love lost whatsoever. These two fight into the crowd. Making the way into the crowd, Finesse now, stiff shot. And you'll notice referee Kevin Blicker being very lenient here. I told him we must crown a new champion here tonight in our main event. Hunter Drake with that big shot dropping Finesse amongst the sea of fans. Finesse distracted by the Carnies and hold on. Carry Awful with that chair in hand. Some ill intentions. <clears throat> Finesse able to make his way out. This is an uphill battle for Finesse. This is exactly what we came to expect here. The numbers game, gonna have to try his best not to be distracted by the Carnies. So they continue the brawl on the outside. Making their way all the way over to the bar here at the canteen. And Hunter Drake now from the bar top. Hunter Drake loves to do this. Look at the floor! Cross body! Certainly no stranger to that high risk offense, Rob. We see it time and time again. Anytime Hunter Drake is looking to make a statement, and what bigger statement than winning the inaugural Tri State Championship Tournament? As if Hunter Drake wasn't a threat enough here to the Retinal locker room. One of the greatest independent wrestlers on the scene today, but joined forces by the Carnies. Certainly thus far looking unstoppable, but that's still to be determined. Hunter Drake sending Finesse back into the ring while referee Kevin is gonna be a little lenient in this one. The pinfall has to be in the ring and we could be seeing it right here as Finesse kicked it out right at two. Gonna take a lot more than that to put away Finesse. Right hands from the knees for totally plastic finesse. Finesse charges in, but eating the kicks from Hunter Drake. Those educated feet. Running shooting star press, knees right to the chest, hooks the outside leg, and just two. That's exactly what I'm talking about there. That freak athleticism from Hunter Drake. Absolutely incredible performer. Shame to see the company he keeps these days. I say it, it can't be denied just how good of a professional wrestler that Hunter Drake is. Hooks the inside leg for the cover. 
Vanessa out at two, but just as you said, that company he keeps. He aligned himself with the Carnies for a reason. Whenever you take that ability that Hunter Drake has this early into his career, we know there's a hell of a lot more life for Hunter Drake in this business, and you align yourself with two veterans, regardless of what we might think about them personally, but we know the accolades of the Carnies, and that's only paying dividends so far in the career of Hunter Drake. And I'm trying my best to toe the company line, call things straight down the middle. But, Rob, I mean, like you said, with the Carnies, it's, it's kind of difficult to do that. It's extremely certainly, difficult. I'd be remiss to say, you know, they've certainly been a thorn in my side my entire era here as general manager. But certainly proving to be effective as Finesse takes down Hunter Drake. Well, if it wasn't for the Carnies and their constant bending of the rules, Carmen, you might still be here at the booth with me full time. It was the, the constant thorn in the side of not just you, not just us, but everybody here at Retinal Wrestling. We needed a change, and we are still fighting for that change, and Finesse wants to be the face of that change here in Retinal. Could not think of a better face of the company than Finesse. So you see these two now exchanging blows. Doing my best to keep an eye here on the outside, make sure things are done the right way, Rob. There is a reason the GM had to be out here for this one. That big clothesline dropping Hunter Drake follows it up with a second. And Carmen, if Finesse can keep this pace up, he might be able to punch his ticket to winning this match and becoming the inaugural Tri-State Champion here in Retinal. Looking to put an end to it now. We can have a new champion. Brain Buster, but holds on. Finesse looking for more. Falcon Arrow, center of the ring, hooks the legs for the cover. But just two. And Nick Iggy almost instinctively there trying to grab the feet of the official, but Hunter Drake didn't need it. Oh, trust me, I noticed. You saw exactly what I saw right there, Rob. Finesse calling for the end. Goes for that scissors kick, but can't get it. Finesse wanted that drop dead gorgeous. And now Hunter Drake, that flurry of offense, looking to take advantage off the miscue. A jackknife powerbomb dropping. Finesse, could we have our first champion? No. Only a two, says referee Kevin Blicker. Working overtime here tonight. The Iron Man of the show, and we thank Kevin for his work here tonight. But still a lot of work to be done. See the Carnies on the outside issuing orders to Hunter Drake. Hunter going up top. This could be it for Finesse. We know Hunter likes to employ that purple haze 450 off the top rope, the double stomps. He's got a lot of different tricks up his sleeves whenever Hunter Drake looks to fly. Bob, if he hits this, it's over. Wants the stomp, oh. but can't get it. But now with a spear! Cutting Hunter Drake in half! This is it! This is it! No! Oh. How can you not root for Finesse? Honestly, a fan favorite from the start here at Retinal. Looking for a submission victory over Hunter. Hunter, though. Hunter rolls into the cover. Finesse able to power out at two. Drake with a super kick, dropping totally plastic. Going up top again. Will he get it this time? Purple Haze 450 hooks the legs. That's it. No! Oh, what? Carmen, how many matches have we called where that Purple Haze won and done? That was all it took. As the crowd here at Workplay Theater coming alive for Finesse, this is exactly what I was hoping for in this tournament. I was hoping to see the best out of each performer. We are seeing the heart of Finesse on full display here. The heart of a champion as Hunter Drake now with the chain from Nick Eagy. Thank God. Here comes Jameson Shook and Big Dave to even the playing field. Iggy and Shook fighting through the curtain. Big Dave has got 
Carrie Awful sending him back through as well. After the Carnies have stuck their nose in the business of everyone in the locker room all throughout the night. Finally an opportunity for Finesse. Face first, plants him, has got the arms hooked. Finesse with the stroke right into the submission hold. Can he do it? Hunter Drake, center of the ring, nowhere to go. Bob, this is it. What, what the hell is this? Hell. Maxwell, classic. Get out of here. Here comes Kenzie Page. That's what I'm talking about. Do it for Retinal. Oh, but big roaring forearm shot from Hunter Drake has rocked finesse. Things have broken down quickly here, but finally an even playing field. Hunter Drake with the chain in hand. Rolls through. This is it. Swamp Dang Gorgeous! Outside leg is hooked. One, B, two, three! Yes! He did it! Rob, if you'll excuse me, I have some business to attend to. Get it to. up there, buddy. Get that championship where it belongs. Let's get it around the race of the first ever Retinal Wrestling Tri-State Champion, Funness! What a night. Totally plastic. Finesse defying the odds, fighting against hell itself here tonight to become the Tri-State Champion. And folks, to hell with this, I want to celebrate too. On behalf of Scotty Moore, on behalf of Carmen Michael, my name is Rob Weathers, and we'll see you next time for more Retinal Pro Wrestling.
title is way bigger than me. This is for everybody who told, who was told they couldn't do it. Okay. You couldn't do it. You couldn't do anything. It's time for us to take up space and prove these motherfuckers wrong. Come on. <laughs>